Hello everybody, welcome back to the Farming Simulator 25 Tips and Tricks video. Today we're going to be talking about tool sheds. Where do I find them? What can I put in them? And why do I care? Late in the Farming Simulator 25 pre-release news cycle, we learned about tool sheds and the ability to store hand tools within them. Well, now that Farm Sim 25 is out, there's other uses for them as well. And I have the three tool sheds that are available to us in the game right here in front of us. Let's answer the first question. Where can I find them? Well, we have to go into build mode. And once we do that, we're gonna come down here to the third icon or the fourth icon here, and then over to others. And here we have three tool sheds. $450 for the small tool shed, $750 for the medium sized tool shed, and $1,050 for the large steel tool shed. Now, let's talk about what can we put inside them. Well, to do that, let's go ahead and take a look inside the small tool shed. And we can store hand tools like chainsaws, spray paint, and horse brushes. We can also store something like, well, the new mobile pressure washer. You know, you're done busy with a hard day of cleaning off your vehicles and it's time to put the pressure washer away well you can just put it away in your medium or large size tool shed and then we have the big tool shed well we can store other things inside here as well maybe your favorite Kubota side by side or maybe your motorbike Now, each tool shed has its perks and its negatives. For example, the large tool shed is going to be able to obviously store the most. We have areas for four chainsaws to be stored, three marker paints, and one horse brush. Meanwhile, the medium tool shed is going to support two chainsaws, two marker paints, and one horse brush while the small tool shed is going to see, support a single chainsaw, marker paint, and horse brush. Now, it's nice that all of this stuff is put away here, but why would I want to do that? Well, up until Farm Sim 25, we had all of this stuff in our pockets, if you will. And if we cycled through our hand tool inventory, either by pressing one or two, or I believe in the old game, it was scrolling up and down with the scroll wheel, at least on PC. Well, it can sometimes be a little confusing, a little bit problematic when next thing you know, you're trying to whip out something else and you pull out a chainsaw. It can be a little cumbersome during a conversation with somebody else. Well, here we can store them away. And in multiplayer, other players on your farm can actually come and pick up a chainsaw, make use of it, bring it back, and store it away. So it's kind of convenient and kind of real to life. Now, how do you get this stuff out of your tool shed? Pretty simple. All you do, walk up to something, and you're going to get R. Take the chainsaw. There we go. We're going to hit 1 to put it back into our hand tools, and there we go. We want a piece of marker paint. Well, we come up here and hit R. We take some marker paint and put that away. And we take the horse brush and, you know, make use of the horse brush. When we're done, we can bring it back. And R, we can put it back. Let's bring up our marker paint. Hit R to return our marker paint. We'll pull up our chainsaw and hit R to return our chainsaw. And there we go. So that, in a nutshell, is the tool sheds. Why would you want them? Well, to put stuff away and have a nice, tidy little farm. Now, it's a little sad that this tool shed has a step up because you could put the pressure washer in here as well, 
if you didn't have that step up, but the pressure washer just won't come up over that lip. Also, just a general bit of advice, when buying the pressure washer, do not get it from the vehicle shop. Instead, get it from the build menu, because then, well, you can place it, and you don't have to worry about going to the shop, picking it up, and putting it on some sort of trailer, and then wheeling it over here to your farm. So I hope this video was helpful in some way. I think a lot of people maybe don't are not aware of these little tool sheds or just don't know where to find them in the game because they're kind of hidden away. But I like the idea of being able to put your stuff away. Although sometimes in my live streams, I tend to just put things wherever. At some point, you know, during winter, you're gonna wanna put all your stuff away all your summer toys and you're going to be able to do that with these little tool sheds i look forward to seeing what modders might come up with with respect to tool sheds as well as other hand tools that we can store within these sheds as well let me know your thoughts down in the comments below with respect to tool sheds and until next time happy farming